Okay, so sand dollar here this morning. It's Monday the 20th. Time is 10 after 6. Sun's just starting to lighten up a little bit the beach where you can see where you've been detecting. Uh, I'm on South Beach this morning doing this one spot I normally do, but I ain't sure if somebody else has been here or not. One thing I found was two uh, pull tabs and bottle cap at this point. Um, I know low tides at 10.30 this morning, so I'm sort of waiting for the tide to go out more and do out further near the water. I know I used that uh, Cutter Skin So Soft uh, bug spray on me this morning. It don't work with a dam, so don't waste your money on buying that. Anyway, let me get back to detecting and see what I can find. And we're gonna have a pretty sunrise. I don't know if you can see it yet or not, but the sky's orange. A few clouds in the distance, but not too bad. We'll see what happens. Yeah, I want to take a break here for a minute. Show you a beautiful, beautiful sunrise. So, I don't know if y'all can see that, but it is awesome. I know the last few days we've had 105 degree heat been like 99 degrees with a heat factor 105 and can't tell if anybody else has been here metal detecting yesterday or the weekend but not finding a whole lot so let you know when I hit another target I know, uh, man, uh, beach is like a lake this morning. No, hardly any waves. I mean, maybe six inches, but it's like a lake. So, that's cool. It's good for fishing. But with it being so calm like this, that means them sharks can come in real close to the in inshore so that's not good but I just want to show you beautiful sunrise man it's getting prettier by the minute it is now 635 so another 20 minutes the sun will be up man awesome awesome only in Florida or this uh I'm going to record this sunrise as I metal detect. As, uh, wow. Look at the colors, man. Unreal. Now, I haven't found nothing except one dime. So, I'm not sure if somebody had been here before me or they haven't. I know, you know, kids started back at school last week. It's becoming our off season. And, uh, our next big holiday is Labor Day in about 10 days. After that, the place is going to die. But I'll keep hunting, see what I can come up with. I know we got I Dig Daytona coming down to New Smyrna. You know, well, obviously he's not digging Daytona coming down here in my territory. Ain't nothing I can do about it, but it sort of sucks. Huh. Stay up there on your beach, man. Yeah, now the sun's up where I can see better. I see signs that somebody else was here yesterday evening. You can see the tracks where they drug their scoop through the sand like I do laying down a grid. So
uh, that's probably why I haven't found nothing. Bottle cap, two pull tabs, and one dime. I could be wrong, but I don't think so. Well, looks like the only good thing coming out of this hunt today is a beautiful sunrise. So, I got here at uh, 5.30. I'll hunt till 9. See what I come up with, but it ain't looking real good. Too much competition anymore. I blame that on Kelly Co. Okay, I just come across a nickel. Been there a while, a lot of patina on it. Um, about six to eight inches deep soft sand. Um, thought it was a pull tab, showed up as a 22, and normally that is a pull tab. <clears throat> Could be a nickel, but in this case it was a nickel. So, that's cool. Tried doing the wet sand, didn't find nothing. So I moved back to the dry sand. All right, let's know if we hit another target. Okay, I've been here now about three and a half hours. All I found was two bottle caps, four pull tabs, one dime, one nickel. So I'm not even going to do a wrap up. Really sucky hunt this morning. The only good thing it was was a beautiful sunrise. So I'll try to get out later this week. It looks like my schedule's really lightened up for the week. And I'll head to a new spot that maybe no one else has done. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Talk to you soon.